Hi there, great to see you again. In this video, I'll show you how to get your webhook secret in Stripe using a few simple steps, all within about five minutes. To start, navigate to Stripe's website. This is an essential step to ensure you're in the right place. Open your browser and type in stripe.com or click the Stripe link if you have easy access to it. Once you're on the Stripe homepage, your next move should be to sign in. Look for the sign in button, usually located at the top right of the page, and click it. This will take you to the login screen where you'll need to enter your email and password. Make sure these are accurate to avoid any access issues. After you've entered your credentials, hit the sign in button again to enter your Stripe dashboard. Now you'll find yourself on the home page of your dashboard, which functions as the command center for all your Stripe activities. Scroll down until you see the Developer section. This is where you'll find various developer tools and settings, including those related to webhooks. In the Developer section, you'll find an option labeled Webhooks. Click on it to proceed to the next step in our journey to get the Webhook secret key in Stripe. Now, to set up your webhook, click on Add Endpoint. This is crucial as it defines where Stripe sends event information. Without this setup, you wouldn't receive the critical data necessary to handle Stripe transactions. Once you've clicked Add Endpoint, you'll be directed to make specific selections. Start by selecting Checkout, then choose Checkout.Session.Completed. This type of event is crucial for processing completed checkout sessions, ensuring your website reacts correctly to a successful transaction. Next, proceed to Invoice and select invoice.payment succeeded. This helps you get notified every time a payment-related invoice is successfully processed. With your selections in place, click Add Endpoint to advance to the endpoint configuration. Here, you'll see a field labeled Webhook URL. You'll be pasting a URL here, which serves as the address for where Stripe will send the webhook information. Take a moment to enter the exact URL you want as the recipient of the data. Then, below that, you can add a helpful description to keep things organized. Use this as a reference point to remind yourself later what this webhook is set up for. Finally, click Save Endpoint to save your configuration. At this point, Stripe sets everything up on their servers to start sending information to your specified endpoint. Concluding the setup. With everything set, you've successfully obtained your webhook secret in Stripe. Now you're all set up to receive real-time event notifications from Stripe directly to your server. Make sure to test this setup in a safe environment to ensure everything is functioning as expected. And there you have it. Simple, right? Thanks for watching and happy developing.